Welcome back. I'm here with another Sheen haul for you. Got nine items to go through, but as always, let's go through that little shipping. Uh, I got my shipment in two orders this time. The first one came out of California. I received it in two days. The second one came out of their China warehouse. I received it in six days. So again, excellent shipping. All right, without further ado, <laughs> let's get into it. So the first item is um, in a 3X, it is $10.57, and I'm glad I went with a three. I could have went with a two, but then I would, if you'll recall from that first sheen haul that I had the issue where I could feel the seam under the arm, I feel if I would have went in a two with this, I would have had that issue but there's more than enough room with this uh the sleeve is my favorite part because we have this beautiful bell sleeve love this it is a faux wrap and it, again if you'll if you watched the first sheen all those v-necks were super low so i appreciate that this is a very decent v-neck and uh it's a crop top like Let's hold the phone. I'm in a crop top right now. What? I don't do crop tops. I do not expose my stomach in the least. Uh, no thank you. So the fact that I actually like this top and want the next top I'm gonna show you, mind blown. But uh, it is just slightly baggy, but they gave these little strings. And you can tie them in the front if you want. Like if I'm being extra self-conscious because this is totally out of my norm. That's my dog in the back walking around. Uh, if I'm totally feeling self-conscious and I want just like a little, this may look stupid, but I want just a little bit of extra material for my sanity's sake. Bam, a little extra secureness. And then bam, got my bell sleeves. I'm covered up <laughs> if I'm feeling self-conscious. But anyway, I was talking about that little extra material. Do it in the back and tie it. We don't have that gap anymore. And then if you want to tie it in the back, do that. Or you want to come back in the front and tie it, you do you. She doesn't like what I video, so she's booked it out of here. But the back is just uh, your typical standard high back. Love this. Okay, the pants. Let me tie this really quick so these strings aren't flopping in the front. Uh, the pants are 3XL. They are culotte split pants. They are $13.01 and they have an adjustable, uh, not adjustable, why do I want to call it adjustable? They have an elastic waistband. So could I have sized down possibly, but it's not like these are overtly big by any means. So we do have um, an elastic waistband. Also, they have a belt that is tap attached. It uh, starts on either side where they're attached at, and you can tie it in the front or the back, whichever direction you want to help cinch your waist. The split is starts at the uh, waistline and then it tapers backwards. I'm at downwards, and I am wearing shorts underneath, but you could in potentially expose your thigh, you know, if a good breeze came through, but at best, you're showing like this part of your skin. Um, I know that's probably geared more toward the beach, but you know, I'm not hating this together. <laughs> and then the shorts are part of Sheen as well. They are a biker short that was $6.71. I got these in a 4XL. I so should have sized down with these. For me, a biker short, I want it to be fitted around the thigh because I personally like wearing shorts under my dresses. That's just who I am, always have. And so that's what I bought these with intention. Well, these are very much loosey-goosey and they're not gonna fit that, but I'm gonna keep them. They're very comfortable lounger on shorts. It's just, they're not gonna work for the intention I wanted. I need to get the proper size I should have went with. Um, but again, those were $6.71. Up next is this little number that's also my shocker that I liked because it's essentially a crop top as well. It is in a 2X. It is neon, obviously, $9.23. Now, this one I went with a 2X because it is a fully functioning wrap. 
shirt. Whereas that one I showed you a minute ago was a faux wrap. So I knew this one had adjustability. Um, it has this bat wing. So again, multiple arms are going to be able to fit through here. I love that. Again, it is a fully functioning wrap. So I like it this way personally, but if you want this piece on top going this way, you do you. I just prefer my wrap to go this way, but all you do is just wrap these strings around you as many times as you want. Tie it in the front, tie it in the back. You know the drill. You do you. Whatever floats your boat. <laughs> and uh, how many times could I say that in this video? But yeah, that's it. <laughs> it's super simple. Will accommodate so many different sizes. Um, it's just a standard high back. But yeah, I like it. <laughs> Surprisingly, color me shocked. Here we have a 2XL tropical dress. It is the most expensive item I purchased. It is $21.81. Again, I got this one in a 2X because I read the size chart, I read the reviews. I cannot stress that enough. Read the size chart, read the reviews. They are so helpful because sometimes I'm a 2X, sometimes I'm a 3X. It all depends. Um, like with that wrap, that neon wrap, I read the size chart and the bust size was like, I don't know the actual measurement, but just say it was like 30 to 45. It was this huge range. The waist measurement was like 35 to 45. You know, it was this big range. So I knew it was going to be accommodating. <clears throat> Sorry. So I knew that when I purchased this one. So I got this one in a 2X. Again, $21.81. Uh, the sleeve is this flutter sleeve. So lovely for all the different arms out there. It is v-necked. I do have it slightly pinned <laughs> because otherwise it would be really revealing. And then this is totally adjustable. You adjust this to your chest. You tie it however you need to tie it to fit your chest. So that's why I was okay with this one being a 2X. The waistband is again one of those elastic waistbands. It is thick. Um, but the waistband, the elastic part is only to the sides. The rest is the material of the dress. You do have a zipper here for the skirt part, which you know me, I don't use the zippers. I just slip it all on and go. Uh, the back is just a standard high back. But the front, it has this wrap to it, which I still have the shorts on. You could essentially reveal yourself but it's so high over you shouldn't <laughs> but the way it's wrapped you do get your ankles and you're able to see your shoes so that's nice but yeah little flutter sleeves nice little dress and then also if you don't want to show that bam pull it up problem solved I bring up the stretchiness because where that stretch had some of where that dress had some of the stretch this dress has no the stretch this is in a 3X, because I knew it had no stretch. The other one was a 2. This is a 3X Geo dress, $17.61. And it fits everywhere but my arms. It is snug right through here, but it's because I have larger arms. I have that armpit issue like I was talking about in the first video. But I do like the sleeve. We go to here, and then we got this seam, and then it kind of has a little slight bell sleeve. Um, it is slightly v-necked and it is a maxi dress. That's the back. Pretty similar, pretty basic you think. No, no, wait a minute. <laughs> now it's like the leaf dress. This is adjustable, you know, if you want to expose all the chest, you do you. If you don't want to expose any of it, pull it down. You want it not exposed at all, you do that. So that's how this works. It is um, loose as a result here. I don't have a huge chest, so it's gonna be loose on me. This is just like that leaf dress. It has an elastic waistband, so this is accommodating. It is a thin waistband, whereas the other one was a thicker band. But this, this dress has absolutely no stretch in the material so that's why the arms of this one is snug 
I could size up and the arms would probably fit, but then the rest of this would be too big. So this is gonna be a return for me. Again, the back has a zipper, but you guys know I don't use the zipper. I just pulled it over my head and went with it. I know it's the return of the black thing, but it's only for this one item, I promise. This is in a 2XL, it is a tea dress. It was $14.26. It has adjustable straps. Again, we have the zipper in the back, which I ignore. We have faux buttons. It is empire wasted, and I know what you're thinking. Stacy, didn't you go on and on and on and on and on and on in that other video about how you hate empire waste? Why are you still doing this to yourself? I know what you're saying. <laughs> and I know I hear you. I hear you. I hear me, okay? But it's a cute dress. And honestly, it had pockets, okay? The pockets sold me. It has pockets. Um, again, I'm 5'3". It is just slightly below my knees. <clears throat> but all that being said, even though it's empire wasted, I kind of got a little bit of a waist here, so I'm not hating it. Like, I don't know if it's because this is like a more structured where those others had that um, elastic empire waist. Maybe that was the issue. I don't know. But I'm not hating this one. We're in the final stretch down to our last two items. Here we have a 3XL tribal jumpsuit, $20.10. And honestly, I don't know why they're calling it tribal because this is more floral in my opinion, but whatever. Uh, I love that it's a longer sleeve and doesn't, you know, it in a cap sleeve or something. I love the length of this sleeve. But if you'll see, it's like floral. Like, this isn't tribal looking to me, but it is v-necked. I do have it slightly pinned right here. Otherwise, it'd be way open. Uh, the waistband has that tribal print as well. We do have a removable belt to help cinch the waist. The pants themselves have this vertical line that's printed on the material. You know, it's not like a raised thread or anything. Uh, and the pants are long for me which I love. Okay, again, I'm 5'3". You can see they are touching just the top of the floor, and I love that. I cannot stand the jumpsuits where they're at the ankle like that. I'm 5'3". This is too short for me. Give me my pant, okay? Also, this is slightly wide leg, but it is not so wide leg. I cannot stand when I go to the stores and try on jumpsuits, which let me pause and interject this for a minute. I have no clue why I keep trying on jumpsuits and rompers. I do not like them on me personally because I feel like the penguin from Batman, okay? So why do I keep trying these things on? In my mind, I'm trying to find one that just looks okay that I can justify and be like, yeah, that looks okay. But every time I try on one, I'm like, no, penguin. So anyway, that being said, the ones I've tried on in the past, the pant leg is super wide leg, and I'm like, I know it's supposed to be wide leg, but that is excessive, yo. And then if it fits up here on the top, it's super big on the bottom, and I've just never found one. And this is okay, but I still don't think I'm going to keep it. Um, the material itself is lovely, like it is super lightweight. Feels amazing. Uh, I'm from Louisiana and it's hot and humid, so this would be great to wear right now. But it's not like it's awful or anything. It's just it's it, it's still not for me. The back does have this little keyhole opening to it. But yeah. Uh, then our final item is this kimono. I purchased another one. This is in a two XL, twelve dollars fifty eight cents. Again. $12.58. This at a traditional plus size retailer, 40 bucks, if not more. So I still am thoroughly enjoying their kimonos. This is the print design. It's red and teal, navy and gold and white leaves. It is three quarter sleeved, which I love. Do not have that weird arm issue. This is a 2XL, so I just don't know what the standard is. Like, 
on some of those shirts from the previous haul, you know, I could feel the arm, the, the seam uh, underneath my armpit, and those were two X's. This is a two X, I don't feel it. That neon was a two X, but it had the flutter sleeve, so I was like, well, maybe not because it's the flutter sleeve, but this is a normal sleeve, and I don't have any arm issues, so love that. It is floor length. So that's everything I've got for you guys. I was all nine items. The only ones I will probably return is this jumpsuit and that geo and probably the leaf tropical dress if I'm being honest. But otherwise I loved everything else. Super satisfied with Sheen still to this day. I mean, you're looking at the price. I'm reading the prices to you. You can match it up to whatever other store that's akin to that. So just know you're paying for what you're getting. You know, the quality is not going to be like what I get at a traditional plus size retailer because, you know, it's going to be a better quality material. Not that these are bad quality at all. It's just, you know, you get what you pay for. And I've been satisfied with what I've had so far. Granted, I've only had that first order, those few items that I kept. Um, and I think that was like a month ago I done that. So I've only had it that long that I've been wearing them washing them trying them and all that and they're still holding up till now granted that's only been like what a, less than a month now so i don't i hadn't had anything for an extended period of time to be able to tell you long term how they hold up but currently i'm satisfied with what i'm getting but anyway that's it like this video if you liked it leave a comment down below what was your favorite item uh till next time i'll see you guys thanks for stopping by